Hi guys, uh, my name is Max, aka Local HJ, and today I'm going to be talking about the swinging system in Amazing Spider-Man 2. Uh, so this game just came out, and I've been messing with the swinging system a lot. It's kind of similar to the swinging system in Spider-Man 2. Uh, so right here I'm going to show you how to do each swing. With the right trigger, you swing with your right hand, but you can also alternate to your left hand. First I go left, right, and then left. And if you pull both at the same time, you get a speed boost, so that helps you uh, gather speed real quick. You can see, taking corners is really natural. Uh, here I'm showing you can let go really high to gain height, or you can let go low to gain momentum right here. Right here, I kind of mess up right quick, but I'm going to show you how to do a, a slingshot move you unlock. Uh, you hold both triggers in A. Now the trick is to keep holding A, but to let go of the triggers, but I mess it up right there. Uh, now I do it again, there you go. Shot. Gives you a little quick momentum. Uh, as you noticed, you do attach to the buildings, but if you go out here into the trees, it does attach to, I believe, nothing. So you can't go higher than the trees. Um, and that's just about it. You also have this web zip mode from the first Spider-Man game, where you can just choose a way and it'll automatically kind of navigate to the... You can kind of keep doing that, chain it together, just tapping the button to see it does like a little run along a bus, jump off a window. It's awesome looking, but uh, it's not as fun as Man complained about before I came. Hopefully that was informative, and uh, hope you guys are enjoying the game. Uh, see ya.